look like a sender sender patch female. I just want to ask for the guide from the other vehicle, Charles Charles. Which profiles is this info? Yeah, oh, okay, okay, thank you. Yeah, we got some just identifying the female. It's really not from Kuhuma Pride because all the Kuhuma Pride, the female, the cows are not the same with these lions. Charles said this female is coming from Sticks Pride, which is one of the pride that have more south of our our property, which it happens from Bush Lodge site in, in, in Cyrus and Juma. It tends to be there, six spot quite a lot. It looks like the men that were coming from s directly south from the opposite side of our neighboring farm with this female enter into area. So you may find that there was cars that they had there that were just cut to come across with Kuhuma Pride and as I, I mean having a little bit fight and then they have you see us get to the back because females and because lions are territorial it means the same species of same gender it can't be the same space if kuhuma females get here they won't be happy with this female they would really like to kill the female because she might be a threat for the youngster for the male they can have on that territory quite few of uh, females that they control That is attraction of mating. Yes, we've done it. And this we're gonna. This is our light, last mate while we're here. And listen for that. Huh. Wonderful. Yes, we have done that. We are, were just waiting for this to happen. And it, it's been, we've been here a little bit long. We're going to leave. Stay with me, we're going to go. We're leaving them in here in peace. Leave them to do their own business. We've been here a little bit while. Last bit was perfect. See ya. You know that from today when the end to mate, we just calculate 110 days mating will take place. I mean, cops will take place. See, the pregnancy period is 110 days. I have a soup there. Yeah? It will be nice. Remember, I left those two. I'm um, a little bit wrestling. It could be the right time now to go and check them. But they're still having that boxing. It's still going on. 
Это будет легко. Раз. As time drop, seeing those lives, it makes us more relaxed. Yeah, it makes us happy. Happy to, yeah. As I said, it will take 110 days. We just calculate for today or tomorrow when it ends, which is three months, <coughs> three months and week and some days. The females will have young stuff. Definitely because she's is coming from Stick Pride. It's not what it was in cuts because it's really operating more suffer for our farm. But we don't have a rice to go there yet. Maybe in future we're able to get to get there and get to see all these lines. Now moving away slightly towards north to make those where the lines are I believe because the lines are very close to Haina Den. It's about 100 meters away from Haina Den. The Haina won't be active today because of the presence of lions. Because of the presence of that male lions. Remember Haina and the lions are very they don't like each other. Especially if it's a dominant male like that one. Hyena won't like to become so close to Hyena. They might come out and go somewhere and leave the space. <coughs> some impala and baboons at uh, daddy camp we're going to cut ourselves and enjoy the baboons and the impala we'll be back to us in a few minutes Hello everybody and uh, welcome back to Gary Water. Sorry, just had a kind of a frog in my throat there. Guys, uh, what an amazing sighting we had seeing those two males, female and male mating. Male is, uh, looks like from Kuma Pride and as Rexton said, female from uh, Sticks Pride. Guys, I've got a rage just to give those oaks a breather, um, have some lovely impala. Uh, you can see a young male in the foreground and of course the baboons uh, in the background just doing their normal grooming for this time of the day and uh, yes we'll cut back to the drive shortly and uh, see what's around Buffalo Dam <laughs> 